discuss one of the very important concepts that you can include in the case study in your answer right and, and also important for your prelims point of view so the topic is coastal erosion and how you can mitigate it with a rising uh, coastal erosion why it is taking place the very first question let's address it so the real cause is the rising sea level which is due to the changing environmental conditions and this rising uh, sea level due to climate change has led to increasing amount of sea water coming into the coastal areas and affecting the coastal region so there is removal of sediments and extreme weather conditions which could be related to cyclones unexpected uh, floods tsunamis and then this has put a lot of damage to the land which is the coastal land has degraded a lot of amount of the coastal land and also has caused indiscriminate damage to the infrastructure in the coastal areas to mitigate it there has been a concept which is released in india predominantly and this is the geosynthetic tubes as you can see in the coastal areas these are the geosynthetic tubes or also known as the geotextile tubes which are engineered structures tube like sack filled up with sand and sometimes gibbons wire boxes with rocks and these are usually in the region between high and low tide area now these are fabricated such that there are regular filling pores so there are areas where you would fill those and then this would control the erosion because the sea waves which would come would hit and then reverse back and would protect the coastal area the land from extreme damage now this fiber material is um, very very resistant resistant to ultraviolet rays extreme outdoor conditions and also help to maintain the ecological shoreline balance land reclamation and consolidation of soft soil so the major benefits is reclamation of land creation of islands if required uh, control of the shoreline erosion revetments breakwaters and dams and dikes could be used now this would have to be built every year maintained every year but it is easy to install has good durability and better accuracy and with this the extreme weather conditions and uh, the rising coastal waters into the region could be checked and these act as actually sea walls now where in india they have been used between 1990 to 2016 it is believed that under the national center for coastal research ministry of earth science we have seen that 34% of india's coastline is under some form of threat the eastern uh, coast of india has two regions upada near kakinada and petha near kendrapada in uh, odisha region both of them were uh, the upada is the first place where geotextile uh, tube have been used and then petha in uh, kendrapara in odisha both of these have been severely eroded it is believed that petha has an erosion of nearly 10 to 15 meter per year and then upada has an erosion of nearly 1.2 meter per year both of them have used submerged and varieties of geosynthetic tubes as one of the methods now odisha is one of the states which is again hit by maximum number of cyclones in india the podam petha village is another important village in the ganjam district which in the last 15 years has lost 200 houses due to this rising sea level and this is one of the areas where rishikulya river actually brings in Uh, or flows in and this becomes the site of extreme sea level uh, changes so government has deployed numerous synthetic tubes in this area in line to check this um, uh, check this system however there have been issues with faulty erosion now uh, this if you see the satellite imagery for 2013 versus 2021 you would see a white line here and this white line indicates that there is presence of this geosynthetic tube in the region so it helps protect uh the erosion in the region it acts as a natural barrier uh helps in dewatering projects are available for large size easy installation better accuracy and are cost effective with good outdoor uh abilities and ultraviolet resistant material which it is uh, engineered with it would also help in, as a break breakwater for hotels beachfronts uh, reduce the damage onto the coastal areas help 
help in sludge removal mining operations dewatering of the wastewater treatment are some of the ways in which these geosynthetic tubes can actually be helpful so if there is a question on coastal erosion geosynthetic tube as one of the case studies should be a um, uh, part of your answer with a special focus to the two areas the potampeda the peta in kendrapana and upada in kakinada so you can mention down then you also have the kalorim beach in uh, goa which has the same concept which is being utilized so those are some of the important things that you can jot down and definitely for practicing more on answer writing we do have the links below in the description you can just uh, read those and send in your answers for evaluation will help you through those thanks for joining in